right, I feel like I've been talking at you all day, but for those joining in right now, I'm so thrilled that you've come back again because we are at the ah, Lawn Fun booth and makes us so happy always. One, to meet with Kelly and, and Mike and Jen Sharkis and Shari and to see all of our great friends here. However, as I left this booth yesterday, I said the ingenuity here is just, it's unbelievable. So wait till you see what Kelly's going to show you because it is fantastic. So Kelly Marie, um, the exciting news of course is there is a new Fawny that is yes. going to be joining the, uh, the community <laughs> of Fawnies and that is super exciting. Congratulations. Yeah, thank you. So, We're so excited. I know. So, and you know, for those of us that had babies 22 years ago, did maternity wear look yes. like this? No. Maternity wear did not look like that. So you It's gotten been, cuter. It's gotten it's way gotten cuter. cuter. So, um, I'm so thrilled to be here. Um, thank you for all you do with the magazine and for all of our Crop and Create event attendees that always get a beautiful gift from Lawn Fun. Thank you. Um, and I'm going to just stop talking and I'm going to let Kelly tell you about the perfection that is behind <laughs> her right here. So okay. let's go. Thank you so much. So I'm so excited to show you guys. This is all of our brand new spring product. It's going to be available on February 20th. And I wanted to start off first by showing you our brand new stencils. So we've never had before. And we're starting with five different kinds and they're scene building stencils so they're really cool so I want to show you guys how they work first of all they have grid lines so if you guys are type A like I am you can use the grid lines to help you line up your stencils we even put special lines for four and a quarter and five and a half inches so you can see how you can easily line up to the five and a half inches there of a standard I'm size I'm trying to car. get the yeah and if you're not type A like Catherine you can just pretend you are <laughs> yeah or you can just ignore those grid lines right. and be like you can't tell me what to do you know <laughs> so that's the grid lines so you would take your stencil you line it up and you can do your inking we used a blender brush and some distress oxides for this one so we're going to ink everything up then what you do is you shift it down and the mask is built into the stencil. That means you can protect your grass as you build your sky. So I love that it's all in one thing, which makes it super, super easy. It really does, it's amazing. Yes, it's awesome. amazing. So we've got some grassy hillsides, we've got plain hillsides. We have one single grass if you want to just try it out. We have this really cool bayou one, and this is amazing. It's a two-step stencil, and you can layer over different greens to create these beautiful vines. We even use the edge of the stencil here to create a nice line. Jess at Lawn Fun Headquarters made this to create the pond and use the other swan in our set to create the look of okay, a reflection. Isn't this beautiful? Honestly, this is stunning. And this is a card. Look how much dimension it has and it's all from ink. Yeah. And that's pretty amazing, right? Right. We also have our cloudy stencil and okay. right here. Are you ready? Cool. Are you ready friends? Because this is what made me super excited yesterday. So you take your stencil, you lay it down, you ink, you take this and you turn it and you ink again. It's a different type of bumpiness of the cloud. You turn it and you ink again and you can keep building up an entire sky this way. Here's another example of a cloud that we built up. The other cool thing is you can continue this on length too. So you could do this on a layout as well because you can just keep lining up the points of the clouds and you can keep making the clouds go across. So you can go as far as you would like on a card, mini album, scrapbook, anything that you're working on. So thoughtful in that design, really. It's really, really fun. So I really like these new stencils. For those of you that are reveal wheel fans, we have really cool new reveal wheel stuff. So we have some new windows. We've got our tulip window, and here you can see that it creates this really cute tulip design. You can have little faces spin around in it. And for those of you that may already have our circle add-on, we've now come out with little frames for it, a flower, a sun, a speech bubble, and a balloon. So I love that you can take something like the reveal wheel and make it totally brand new again. We also have a brand new stamp set called Reveal Wheel Circle Sentiments. And as you spin the wheel, it builds the phrase. So you get the happy birthday to you, which is so super cute. I really love this set because not only is it cute in Reveal Wheel, but you can use it on its own as well. Or you can fit it in our new balloon dies and in our new magic iris die. I'm going to be showing you guys in just a second. Now, it happens to be Lawn Fawn's 10th birthday, which I can't believe. <laughs> so we had to do a super cute birthday set, and that's this set right here. So you can see the little critters can jump on a trampoline, they can hang off balloons, and they can even high five. And this is such a cute set, and you can see right here we made a little pull tag card. This uses those stencils too, and as you pull, the little bunny jumps on the trampoline. So it's so cute, so much fun, and I love creating the scenes and coloring these guys in too. 
My favorite set from the release happens to be this little Dandy Day set. These little mice are absolutely adorable. So much fun to make little scenes with them. You can see how adorable these guys are. And in this card, we've also used our brand new Oliver Stitched ABCs. So they're super, super cute. They're the perfect size for cards. They're also a really great size for layouts too. They're like that perfect happy medium size. So I really, really love these letters, and they work with some of our new pop-ups as well, and I'll be showing you guys that in just a little bit. Now there's that swan set that I told you guys about, which is so super cute. I just love these swans. And we have a new stitched pond frame and all these beautiful die cuts that can go along with it too. We have two cute little mini sets. So we have our little Charge Me Up set, which is really cute for light-up cards if you guys have ever made those. And then our Year 10 stamp set, so we're reading our 10th birthday. And I love the sentiment, I hope your birthday is on point. It always cracks me up. We have a really great new birthday sentiment set called Offset Sayings Birthday. You can stamp the solid on its own or the open lines on its own. I really like to color these in rainbow order. Or you can layer them. And if you guys checked out the Starbucks cups, this winter they had this type of design on there so we had our offset tanks that came up before the cups came out and we were so excited to see the cups in the same style and so now you can do that style for birthday cards as well we have a really cute new set up here and it's called a bug deal and there's these cute little bugs they're perfect for a lot of our existing interactive dies so flipping awesome reveal wheel all these different things and you can see just how cute these cards turn out with it these little bugs are adorable they're really fun to color in bright colors and we even have a little add-on for it that's called hey lady with the cute little ladybugs and that magnifying glass that has a die that cuts out the center that is absolutely perfect for your reveal wheel as well we have a really cute Easter before and after set that works with our magic picture changer and some great sets that are perfect for building tags and bookmarks with little springtime characters and I love that you can put their little buns on the back of the tags this superstar set is one of my favorites. I love this little mouse with the telescope. The sentiments are so adorable, and the cards turn out absolutely gorgeous with that. So here you can see just how cute that is. And that even has our brand new Lift the Flat Meadow. It's got these cute little things you can add to your cards with little peekaboo windows that are just so adorable. adorable. We also have our new Meadow Backdrop. So this die here, we saw it earlier. You push it through your die cut machine just once and you get all these little hills. You can tuck things into them. I love how it makes making a seam card really quick and easy, but the cards with it turn out so, so cute. Oh my gosh, Kelly, that's amazing. <laughs> just amazing. And now we're going up to my favorite, the Magic Iris. So this yes. is the Magic Iris die. And this is what it looks like. So it looks kind of crazy, right? But this is what it creates. So if you guys see here, you pull the tab, and you get this amazing action. So you can see that cool, almost like aperture opening and closing on this card. I absolutely love making these. That's, They're really yeah. easy to make. They look so cool. Yeah. Uh, you can and they look complicated, them. but not at all. They're not. No. They're easy to do. We taught them to over five classes here, and everybody left with a magic iris. They're really fun to decorate with any papers, any stamp sets. We even have some add-ons that can decorate them too. So you can take the iris, and you can actually integrate it into your card front with this add-on. So look how beautiful this is. I love that the sentiment is kind of finished off inside the iris. So as you pull, isn't that so cool? Then we also have one here with the new scalloped add-on. So if you guys take this out, you're gonna see that we're gonna pull this and now we're gonna have that ladybug open up in the center. So right here you can see the ladybug's going to open up with that magnifying glass, which is so super cute. Someone had a really great idea to put acetate behind that magnifying glass, and it would look oh, like a real magnifying yeah, glass, what? right? That's awesome. I just love that. Now, this is those new pop-ups I was telling you about, and they're great because they're easy to use. You just fold them up and put them inside your card, but look how cool they look. And those Oliver Stitched ABCs that we looked at earlier, they fit perfectly on top of the pop -up. amazing. So everything mixes and matches and works really, really well together. We also have some fun scene builder stuff. We have some stitched bouncy trails that cut just stitching and cattails to create scenes for your beautiful little swans. We even have these cute new treat dies. This is our spring critter huggers. And if you look down here, it makes a bunny, a chicken, a duck in one a die. And they can hold little candy, so it's perfect for Easter. And we have a little rolled roses die that helps you make these cute little roses out of paper or felt. And I love adding them to these critters. 
And then here, I have to show you guys. So we have a tiny gift box, and we have all these critters you can add to it. The brand new one is the ladybug, which is so cute. But check out all of these guys. Aren't they amazing? Like, it's just absolutely beautiful. I just love them. They're so much fun. I have them all sitting at my desk at work. So they're all just kind of staring at me, and they make me smile every day. <laughs> I don't think there's anything in this booth that wouldn't make somebody smile. Right? You know? I know. Yeah. Like, happy amazing. colors, cute really critters. Amazing. So we're going to go as the unzip your sweatshirt to take it off. And it's like, um, and with papers. So this is Hello Sunshine Remix, and if you guys are longtime Mon Fon fans, you might recognize it. It was actually from five years ago. We had so many requests to bring it back, we thought we would. So it's a remix, so we reimagined it just a little bit. And the papers were so cute. You can see just how gorgeous they are. I just love them. Everything coordinates really nicely. They're really happy and bright and fun. I'm really excited to see what you guys are going to create with them. They're just so beautiful. And we have little notebooks that kind of coordinate with our two new paper collections. So you get two notebooks in a pack and they're like the perfect little purse notebook. I like to decorate them too and look at the inside of it. Isn't that so cute? So they're just the sweetest little notebooks. I write my grocery list in them, all these different ideas I have for new products. We have one with little dandelions and then also our clouds and our rainbows. Rainbows forever if you guys are 80s girls like I am. <laughs> We have new shimmer card stuff you guys are gonna love. I'm hoping we can get it in the light. See, can you see that in the? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you see it's got a beautiful shimmer and texture to it and the most gorgeous color palette. They come in assorted packs, so you get five of colors, two of each color. So five colors, two of each color, and they're just really, really pretty. It also really fills out the rainbow of our cardstock. Um, it just has these gorgeous, gorgeous colors to them. And then we have Dandy Day, and if you're familiar with our Watercolor Wishes and Spiffy Speckles, they're in a similar color palette as those. And you can see it has this dandelion pattern on it, but it's kind of abstract, so it makes the perfect background on your cards. And of course, we have six by six pads in both of these collections too, and I love the little six by six pads. They're so much fun. We also have some new twine. So this twine is amazing. It's actually variegated. So you can see as you pull, the color changes. So it's got sparkle and it goes from light pink to dark pink to white. And the other one goes from light blue to dark blue to purple. We have a new no line coloring ink. We have it in a baking pad and in a little mini. And this mini pack here is perfect for alcohol marker friendly stamping, water coloring, and colored pencils. So these four inks all work perfectly with all those different mediums. It's a great little mini pack to try them all out. We also have some fun little extra things. We have a new tote bag here. It's 100% cotton and it's screen printed right in our backyard. Um, we just absolutely love them. There's right in San Clemente if any of you guys are uh, Southern California beach fans. And so this little tote bag is absolutely adorable. I love it. And we're also making little tiny baby onesies too because you know my son needs some cute mom fun. <laughs> so they're super cute. The perfect little baby shower gifts as well. So I'm really excited about this release the magic iris is like i'm just waiting to see what everybody thinks oh i know that's like the part i'm most excited about that is amazing yeah <laughs> so Kelly, thank you thank you for oh, joining thank us you. and thank thanks for, for taking me. us on a great tour of the booth um, and if you look right here you'll see everybody's doing some great make and takes yeah i know we're crafting we're making easter cards and yeah. birthday cards and just having a blast yes. <laughs> so thank you friends oh thank you so Good much to see you. <laughs> Bye.